That's my song, y'all. By India Ari. He got that magic. Yeah. He's got that magic. All right, y'all. We're going to have a little more fun. Um, What we're we going to talk about? Cheap men. We all been through this before. We all have been through this before. But I'm going to give you some signs to pay attention to. So you can know to exit. Okay. This is my channel, y'all. Alright, so, you go out to dinner, he stop and get some gas, he put $15 in the tank, okay, and he, and he not embarrassed that he did this in front of you, not at all, take notes, he's got that magic. I know I'm messing my video up, y'all, with this. This is my jam. The way it touches me, so very sure. It's like a miracle. <laughs> All right. Back to the content. So, yeah. So, y'all off to the restaurant. And when he asks you, what all you get? Not what you going to get to eat. Peep it out. Then, ooh, he want to know so he can add it up, okay? But what you do is, you tell him what you going to get, but you pop in that appetizer when the lady get there, okay? And then... You know, when he asked you, are you going to eat all of that? You was hungry, weren't you? <laughs> he cheap, girl. Real cheap. Then when you notice, at the end of the day, he don't want to tip. You bust them out, girl. You know you're supposed to tip, tip like 10%, right? You got to tip. Okay? He cheap, girl. And then, you know, say you might have been in his house to visit. Because don't go in his house because you will really be a cheap date. Okay? He ain't going to never take you out if you go to his house. Never go to a man's house. Unless he ain't went on close to 300 dates with you, okay? So, you be like, um, I just got to use the bathroom. This the kicker, child, when you going to know. You go in that bathroom and he got that thin piece of tissue. You know what? Just... Just come out the bathroom and say you had a you have an emergency and you gotta leave right now. And you will call him. And you run out of there. Just throw him away. And no need to keep him. Because you know, you take that, I'ma tell you why. But you take that number and you take it out your you know, you go back to contact and you put cheap tissue. So when he call you, you, you know, you won't answer. And the reason you just throw him away is because down the line, because you let all that slide, you will find yourself a wife with kids working hard because he's so cheap that he wants you to go half for him on everything, child. Next thing you know, you got a damn roommate as a husband. And he wants you to sleep with him and all that when you could have just went and got a roommate that you ain't even got to do nothing with. Okay? Peep out the cheapness. Because that's what's going to happen in the long run. All of that stuff, you know. 
always want to stay and watch a movie. Let's pick up some Chinese food and watch a movie. No. Let's go to the Mexican restaurant. No. You tell him you eat good dining. Okay. I always want to just be like, let's go get some drinks. That's not no date going to get no drinks. Okay. So, quit doing a cheap date because that can turn into a roommate. Okay. Y'all like how that right? Cheap date will turn into a roommate. Huh? So, y'all pick up them signs. Pay attention to them cheap date signs, okay? And get you some real dine-in men, okay? All right, have a good one.